Hi, I'm Owen Lucas. I'm a master's student at Trent University and a 2021 recipient of the W. Garfield Weston Graduate Fellowship for Northern Conservation. I would like to sincerely thank the W. Garfield Weston Foundation for their generous support of my work. My research is focused in the Northern Boreal Mountains region, specifically the Kluwani Lake region of Yukon, Canada, and focuses on the topic of increased shrub cover within the boreal forests of this region, a concept referred to as shrubification. There is strong evidence that shrubification is occurring rapidly across Arctic regions as a direct result of rapid climate warming in the north. Most of the research on the topic has occurred in the tundra, but based on anecdotal reports from researchers who have been visiting Kluwani for decades, it's clear that dramatic changes in shrub cover have also occurred in the boreal forests of this region. This has likely had major impacts on both forest dynamics and wildlife, but the extent of these changes and their subsequent impacts are currently unknown. The main objective of my research is to assess the extent that shrubification has occurred in the Kluwani Lake region and establish a methodology that can assess this change across space and time and can also be applied unanimously across the boreal forest. We're combining measurements of shrubs taken in the field with high resolution LIDAR and multispectral data, which we're collecting using an unmanned aerial system. These data allow us to make highly accurate estimates of shrub cover, species composition, structure, and abundance at a fixed point in time. Using machine learning techniques, we're then establishing relationships between these estimates and imagery collected from satellites. By applying these models to all available moderate resolution satellite data, we are able to make the most accurate possible estimates of how shrubification has occurred from 1984 to the present day and effectively look into the past to study these changes. The support of this fellowship has allowed me to purchase the necessary equipment to make this research possible and has also facilitated the requirements for traveling to and from Kluwani from Ontario. I have learned many new skills including piloting drones, methods for field data collection, and even how to sleep in minus 20 weather. With your support, I have the opportunity to greatly advance our understanding of ecosystem dynamics in Kluwani and establish a novel method for assessing shrubs that can be scaled up to cover larger areas. We've been set back a bit by unpredictable weather and delays in equipment purchasing, but we've started making excellent progress that will continue through this coming field season. I'm very excited to finish collecting the necessary data and share my results with the public. Once our results are finalized, we plan to further extend this research by looking at the roles a warming climate, changing disturbance regimes, and soil productivity have had in driving these changes. We also plan to examine the impacts this has and continues to have on local wildlife populations, such as the Arctic ground squirrel whose extirpation from the region's boreal forest closely followed the expansion of shrubs. We hope our methods will be applied across the boreal biome to get a global understanding of how these changes are occurring and the threats it may pose to ecosystems worldwide. We believe that our work can provide considerable insight into what the future of northern boreal forests look like and inform more effective conservation and management strategies. Thank you again to the W. Garfield Foundation for Northern Conservation and to Wildlife Conservation Society Canada. I look forward to continuing to share my progress and work with you all in the very near future.